coming in, you just never know on these signing days. It's a, it's a, it's obviously a huge accomplishment to be, to be signed to a Division One team and to know you have a, a full, you know, a full scholarship for four years, and it's a great accomplishment. But at the same time, you still got a lot of work ahead of you, and there's a lot of veteran guys that are already on the team, you know, the sophomores, juniors, seniors that are, they've been doing this for a little while. And they're not just gonna let you come in and, and take their spot. So you're gonna have a, a lot of work to do, and you gotta set new goals and and you know, try to make the best of your time here because it goes by really fast. Definitely those conversations about guys that, have, that come in with the, you know, the three, four stars. or Even when I was here at Rice, there was guys that would come in with, say they would have you know, four stars or three stars, and they would, you kind of, you look at those guys, you're expecting them to be something special. And if they don't come in with that work ethic and that attitude, it doesn't really matter because they're not going to be successful. They're not going to contribute on the football field. I remember during like the whole recruiting process, my parents were just like telling me to not like, stress about it because that was kind of your reward for all the hard work you've done. So it was actually very smooth. Uh, our high school just, you know, they had a little deal where all the guys who were signing got together, just like every other high school. But, um, you know, just a sense of accomplishment, I guess, you know, that you was finally done, that you sent in the paperwork and that you were, you were there and I was coming to Rice. There's a lot more that goes into this game than, you know, just your physical attributes that you get rated on. Here. And of course it's hard as a, as, a, as a kid in high school to not look at those types of things. And um, I even like when I talk to kids now and they get caught up in that, I say, you know, a lot of guys, you know, develop later. And I said, don't get caught up in all that. Just, just play, play hard, just stay with it. And I mean, you really don't ever know what's gonna happen. Cause there's a lot of those guys that are five stars that I don't, I don't see them anymore at all. I don't know, it was the best time of my life, you know, was moving on from high school and I was really excited about it. Just couldn't wait to get here. I was gonna walk on somewhere um, and then Rice uh, got me late. So I, I was definitely on board. It's all about what you do when you get here. Um, and every day is kind of an interview, and that's kind of how me and Shadow works. We, we come in every day and get better each day, and I feel like that's kind of how we got to where we are now. No, it's, it's an awesome experience, man. It's, it's a new chapter for an amazing time in your life. Uh, it was a couple years back, man, but it was definitely a blessing just going through it. It's kind of way too crazy. I mean, these guys now are like freaking superstars, man. See, when I was there, I was the only guy that signed at Taylor. So we were in a small little room in the library. Nobody came. There's no cameras, none of that. But uh, but now I went there just now to see my little brother sign. They got cameras all over the place. You know, guys that have like three different hats and they're choosing his hat, putting his one out. Let's get it. This is a circus. But yeah, it was good times back in the day.